now are we ready for our first guest? Because we so yeah. I'm going to shift to my left. All right. Shift to your left and welcome in the welcome fabulous. Ava Yay! Every time I see you, your hair looks significantly different, Ava. But it's, it's all beautiful. always been great. Well, it's gorgeous. You have been I, a, I one of my off. inspirations. <laughs> Well, so thrilled that you are here with us. We always love hearing what you have going on and what you what you're doing. But Nancy, Nancy, we owe her a, a big introduction. A Give big her a big introduction. introduction. Okay. Well, Ava is the executive director of Special Spirit at Moonshadow Ranch, which is a ranch that um, uses uh, a learning model. Uh, for animal and equine assisted therapy. And uh, Ava started Special Spirit in 2006. Uh, it came from her love of horses back in her native Sweden. Yeah. Right? Yeah. And um, she uh, became aware of the incredible connection between animals and kids, all kids, uh, and neurodiverse kids. So um, Ava is a PATH International Certified Writing Instructor and an Agala Certified Equine Specialist. And she has many programs here at the ranch. Um, yeah. yeah, you have a few. Maybe mm -hmm. you can tell us about a couple of those. But the main reason we have you here today is because you've got a really great program coming up at the ranch. Yes. Well, we, we're going to have a summer camp here. And I'm very excited because I have a teacher that has her background in Montessori, Waldorf, and the forest school teaching in Sweden. And she's been a teacher at something called the Victra School in Sweden, where kids, all kids with all uh, abilities, have a chance to basically create their own curriculum. It's sort of, it's a freedom of learning. And they are out in the forest a lot because we have a forest in Sweden. Mm -hmm. And we're going to try and recreate that a bit during the summer here. And we're also going to work with the horses, walk and talk, uh, social riding, and arts and craft, singing, dancing, and just have fun together. Amazing. And we're doing it for three weeks in July, July 11th, and then the 18th. And I think it's the next one is on the 21st or something. If you go to our website, specialspirit.org, scroll down on the homepage, you will get a link to the, uh, to the camps. And okay. all the information is there. I always like to ask, who's the ideal camper? Like, how old are they? What, what, is, what are their ability levels? What are you looking for, Ava? Everybody, because everybody has the ability to be to be at camp. And with the way it's set up with the regional center now is that if, okay, the requirement to be in a camp here is that you have to go be potty trained so you can go to the bathroom on your own okay. and take directions. If you cannot do that, I know that regionals, through regional center, you can get an aid, one-on-one -on -one aid. And I think even some regional center pay for the, for the camp. Because the whole idea with my camps are that we all have different abilities. And I found that all kids figure out a way to help one another, whether they are typical, which I hate that word, because we're all, we're all the same yeah. in a way. So I've seen so many great friendships being created in our camps when a neurodiverse and a non-neurodiverse create friendships and do sleepovers or whatever. So they are like everybody else, which yeah. we try to create here. Yeah. Okay. So once again, where can people go to find out more information? If they go to www.specialspirit.org and scroll down to the bottom of the homepage, that is the ran uh, ranch camps. And you click on that and it takes you to the page where all the information is. And people can also find out about information about taking riding lessons here. For yeah, we, what we're doing children. now is the walk and talk because we found that there is many therapeutic riding centers that offer riding. Our horses are getting old, so we do what's called walk and talk. We, we found that there is a lot of uh, uh, socialization that's missing among, mm -hmm. among our clientele of people. And with this, they can walk, they go out together in a little group and they talk to one another. And God, do they talk a lot. 
<laughs> once they get going, you know. Great. So I've seen I've seen uh, one of the kids we had here in the beginning. He did, didn't want to be touched, uh -huh. and then just a couple of weeks later, he asked his uh, fellow rider if he could have a hug, ah, and that is yeah. huge. That's great. And one the, of the, the things point, you have, I'm, I'm, oh, yeah. I'm sorry. Go ahead. No, and then a, a new program that. That was not my idea. It was one of the kids that came here to ride. And one day he brought a book and he stood in front of Cherokee, one of the horses that Blippi rides and read to the horse. Mm. And he read in such a way with different voices and everything. So the parents were in awe of him. So now we have a little read to the animals program as oh, well. Great. Yes. I love but that. that has not really been implemented yet, but it's in the works. There's so many it. other animals here besides the horses. There's uh, alpacas, there's goats, there's sheep, there's pigs, there's dogs, there's cats, donkey, uh, donkey mini horses. miniature horses. Yeah, we donated our miniature horse here, uh, Jasper Mini Moon. Yeah. And uh, so there are many, many other animals here besides just the horses that kids can learn to bond with and yeah. communicate with. You have on your website, Ava, a quote from Dr. Temple Grandin that says, I wish more kids could ride horses today. People and animals are supposed to be together. We spend quite a lot of time evolving together and we used to be partners. And this is, this is a quote you love. Tell us why. Well, I see. And, and that's the reasons why I started it, because my, uh, my godson was here at the ranch and I saw the connection he got with the horses. And he's on the spectrum. He's now like uh, 28, 20. No, he's just turned 30. Mm. And, uh, and that's what, what I saw, the uniqueness with how animals so take us in if we allow to be present, which all our neurodiverse clienteles are. They're always present. Mm -hmm. And so if we can learn what they already know, we will be there soon. Right. Amazing. Amazing. So again, where do people go to get information about the camp? www.specialspirit.org. Scroll to the bottom and click on ranch camps. There we go. There you go. Very cool. Okay. There it is. And yes. Look, look at all those different things that you yes. guys have going on. Absolutely amazing. You're incredible, Ava. I don't know how you have the energy to do what you do. Because I have people like you and Nancy and many others around me. I don't do this on my own. No, I cannot take any credit. Just a little bit. I well, feed the animals. Your ranch is a very special place. I know it's it's a special place in Nancy's heart as well. Sure is. Yes. Amazing. So. Well, yes. we think, is there anything else that you guys want to talk about that's happening at the ranch? Uh, well, we do have a program that I'm the director of called Recovery at the Ranch, which is for uh, those in alcohol and drug addiction treatment centers mm -hmm. that we That's do. Rescue. Yes, we do a uh, half day program here, which uh, employs a 12 step meeting of Alcoholics Anonymous. We start with that. Then we take the participants on a tour of the ranch and have them bond with the other with all the animals here. Some of the ones that I had mentioned earlier. And then we do equine assisted learning uh, with the horses. And then we do meditation. Um, and so it's a, it's a whole half day program that we just recently started that we're very excited about. And now how can people find out more information about that, you guys? They go to that same page and go, go to a animal assisted uh, therapy and activities. Okay. Uh, amazing. How is it going? It's going great. We've had a couple of groups out so far and it simply miraculous what we experienced. Um, I know it's very near and dear to your heart, Nancy. Yes, I'm so it is. proud of you that Thank you're doing you. that. Thank you. Uh, remarkable. And, and again, I hope people know that if you hear something and you, and you live in the Los Angeles area and you think I'd like to do that, but I can't afford to send my child to camp or I can't afford to do this, that you'll reach out anyway, because sometimes there are other resources like the regional center and other things that can help you to be able to, um, be able yes. to do the very minimal cost. You're very affordable, Ava. We, uh, we always try to be creative and win-win is what we're looking for because, because sometimes 
people can help with things that we need here at the ranch and we barter. There we go. I love it. Mm -hmm. Love it and love you and love your very special ranch there. Thank you so much for taking the time to be with us. Well, I live here, so there was no problem. Thank you so (laughs) much, Sarah, for having me on.